Yo, how's it going everyone and welcome back to my channel. Now today I'm going to be vinyl wrapping the interior trim pieces on my car. And I've never done this before, so I don't know how it's gonna turn out. I've never really worked with vinyl. I don't really have any, any experience with vinyl wrap, so not too sure how it's gonna turn out, but I'm gonna go ahead and try it just because it's content for you guys. And I know that a lot of you probably wanna try this because some of the FRS and BRZ trims, they are an ugly silver that doesn't really flow with the interior of the car. And I wanna change that up. So I did buy some vinyl wrap. I have this new, this brush black vinyl wrap. And I bought it off eBay for only 15 bucks for this big old roll. I bought a big roll just so I have room for air and if I do fuck up, then I have more. So before I start on the wrap, I wanna say thank you guys so much for 25,000 subscribers. It really means a lot to me because I've been putting in a lot of effort into my videos and I know that you guys do notice it and I really appreciate the support. Also, if you guys haven't seen that yet, I do have a new edit that I just dropped a couple days ago. I'll have the link right up here. So if you guys haven't seen the video, make sure to go check that out. It's probably one of my latest and greatest works. I'm really proud of what I did and I can definitely see the improvement from my last video, or from my very first cinematic video. It's crazy to see how much I grew and it's all thanks to you guys because you guys support me and you guys motivate me to keep on grinding keep on pushing and to keep refining my skills. So thank you so much for you guys' support. Let's go ahead and get started on this install. I'm gonna first start by taking off the trim pieces and then we can go ahead and start wrapping the actual trim pieces. Let's get to it. All right. Before I start removing the trim pieces, let me kind of show you what my interior looks like as of right now all right so as you can see the these interior trim pieces are silver this is silver the door handles here are silver ac vents and yeah that should be about it but right now i'm not too happy with how the silver looks so i'm going to be switching it up to that black vinyl i showed you guys earlier Okay, let's go ahead and start by removing the the easiest ones first. Now let's get to removing the shift knob so I can access this shifter trim. Bam, I love this shift knob setup. One of my favorites, probably by far. Got that nice vertex engraving going on in gold to match with the gold extension. It's a work of art, man. All right guys, a little update. I am trying to remove these trim pieces here, but I'm finding it to be quite difficult. Apparently you do have to remove this whole center console in order to be able to pull this piece out. And as you can see on the driver's side right here, I got frustrated. As you can see I pulled off this trim piece that's supposed to go here on the driver's side and broke off a tab. But no big deal, happens all the time. Now I know. Need to remove this whole center console piece which I have here. And then hopefully I will be able to pull these out. No problem. All right, I did finally was able to get these side panels off. Bam. Took a little bit of effort. Had to remove the entire center console in order to access the, the screws here. And then, yeah, it was just a kind of a bitch, but everything's out now. Let's go ahead and bring it inside and then start on this wrap for you guys. All right, and before wrapping anything with the vinyl, you wanna make sure that all the surfaces are clean and smooth. The smoother the surface is, the better your results will be.
All right, all the pieces are clean and ready to be wrapped. Okay, so I'm gonna start by wrapping the easiest part first. Just so I can get a hang of how the vinyl works and how it stretches. And hopefully I don't fuck up, so... Here it goes. Okay, well, the first piece is now done. Let's see. On to the next. What's up guys? It is a new day. I have not finished wrapping the interior trim pieces as you can see here. My room is a mess. Please forgive me. I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this wrap. Hopefully it doesn't turn out too bad. Oh yeah and you know one thing I really love about my hair is that I can wake up like this and not have to do anything to my hair. I mean, it stays pretty formed, surprisingly, when I wake up. I would, I would expect, you know, half of my head to be flat, but it keeps it the volume. I have two more pieces. Actually, four more pieces. This piece, and I really want to redo this piece.
right, so I finished this second piece, or this, this piece right here, the door handle. And uh, it's probably my best one yet. Because I started to learn how the vinyl works and how to wrap it around the edges. It's just that you need to use the heat gun. And the heat gun is actually really crucial in how good your wrap's going to turn out. So one piece down, time to move on to the other side. piece. Won't be, <laughs> you won't be able to tell it, right? I mean, you guys probably can't see on the camera how bad this is, but I tried my best. I tried my best. the pieces wrapped not too shabby not too shabby I mean there's some places that are really shitty but overall not bad for a first time all right let's go ahead and install the trim parts before I get stuck outside all right Bang. we are back in the car let's go ahead and start putting everything back onto it and we should be good Yo, how's it going everyone? It is a new day and I know this is the third day on this vlog so bear with me. The reason why I'm vlogging again today is because yesterday after installing the interior trim pieces it was starting to get dark and I wanted to get like a little cinematic edit for you guys so that's why I continued it on to today and now I am here at the Great Mall parking garage. Originally I was going to be shooting outside but it started raining really hard and couldn't do it. So I came up to Great Mall. We are now in a parking garage. It is raining pretty hard outside. I'm not too sure if you can see that, but it's raining and kind of ruined my plans for the shoot that I was going to do today, but it's okay. I'm in a garage. I'm going to go ahead and 
set up my gimbal so I can kind of get a little edit in for you guys and hopefully get some good shots of the interior so you can kind of see how it looks now compared to before. Alright guys, that's going to end the vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed the edit that I put out. If you guys aren't subscribed to my channel, please hit that subscribe button. I know a lot of you watch my videos, but you guys aren't subscribed to me. So if you like the content that I'm bringing out and if you like the content that I am creating, please be sure to hit that subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And if you guys liked this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you think the interior looks a lot better than what it did before. So thank you guys for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next vlog. Oh, 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 oh,